Okay, gang. Uh, end of day 10. Uh, man, it is, it is tough to get a lot of miles in. Uh, 12 hours today, um, over 500 miles, and got into the checkpoint in time uh, to just kind of get situated, have a little bit of stuff done, and then storm to open up and it got dark and um, not that riding in the dark is a big deal but on new roads and in the middle of a storm probably not the smartest thing so mike and i it, it hooked up with mike again um he and i've decided we're going to leave in the morning so that gives us four days to make the last run and beat the 14 day original goal right which is for an elite finisher so that's what we're trying to do it is on the shade of an outside chance that maybe friday night late friday night you know like midnight ish is possible but a lot of it is just going to depend on how fast we can get out of frankly how fast we can get out of the northeast the northeast roads up here are just they're beautiful. Don't get me wrong. This is nothing against the Northeast. The the, the countryside is gorgeous. Um, the views are gorgeous. We saw, I, I drove around Lake Placid today. Never saw Lake Placid before. Drove into the Adirondacks and uh, uh, Lake Ontario this morning. And uh, by the way, thanks for all the answers on the uh, barn quilts, uh, apparently inspired by Pennsylvania Dutch. Um, to ward off sort of like drought and blight and things like that. So uh, learn something new every day. Um, but really, really incredibly gorgeous. But the roads and the speed limits and uh, the number of small towns that you have to slow down for and all those kinds of things really make it difficult to get uh, some distance going even after spending, you know, 12, 13 hours in the saddle. So um, we are gonna make a run we're gonna make it i'm gonna feel confident that we're gonna make it in the 14 day elite finisher cutoff i don't know what time uh hopefully we'll know more as we get you know closer towards the end of the week appreciate everybody's patience and support um we are oh by the way this is wilkins harley davidson which is um uh in vermont um in bar b-a-r-r-e i think that's bar not barry but uh, bar vermont um and uh probably gonna sleep here tonight and uh get cracking at it tomorrow and uh, see if we can make that run home um do my best to try to post more today it was just a long tough day and uh needed to try to to get get the time going but uh thanks everybody for uh supporting i can't believe we're almost done oh and i took a shower oh I mean, let's face it, there are some things that are in my clothes bag that really should just be burned right now. But I had this first shower I've had in eight days, uh, nine days, ten days. First shower I had in ten days, and it felt so good. I think it's the best shower I've ever had. <laughs> so, anyway, um, I love everybody. Appreciate all the, the kind words, support, and encouragement. Um, I'm, uh, I, I'm, I have a little less comfort you know the two days of cushion that i built in um are seemingly gone <laughs> uh so now i've really got to uh, hopefully don't have any mechanicals or you know any of those kinds of things and uh hopefully we can we can make it in uh saturday for that that 14 day uh, uh finisher so anyway uh, i'll update more as things go along hope everybody has a uh, peaceful night and uh, we'll see you tomorrow thanks bye